Did nothing I pat post even come through? Yeah, we back. So, my router is doing this thing again. It, it does this like every few years and it's really stupid. Hang on. Okay, so, yeah, so, our router, every few years, I, I beat this stupid beaver thing, by the way, every few years, or, like, after our router gets so old, it will, like, do this thing where a few times a week, the internet just goes out, and... It's happening now where the internet just keeps going out for no reason. And I'm getting really mad about it. Because it always goes out in the middle of the day when I'm trying to stream. And it's like every six years they have to sacrifice a new son to it. Well, it's like every six months it feels like. But they've had to come out here and like, fit, like replace our router. And they've had it happen where they've replaced the router a few times. And then they're like, oh, haha, ha, it's actually a problem with the pole. Um, but yeah, every every once in a while, the, the router just decides, like, oh, I'm going to shut back down. And it does that. And, like, you literally just have to go in there and turn it off and on again. But it's really annoying because it just, like, the whole thing stops working. What do you want, Steam? Close. I'm not worried about it right now. Leave me alone. Um, but yeah, that's what it's doing. Um, and it's not just been today during my stream. It's happened a few times. Like, I've lost the stream a few times because of it. Um, so that's really annoying. But it's not even just that. It's like, if I'm gonna have one of these jobs, like call center jobs where I work from home... How am I supposed to, like, how am I supposed to work if my internet won't work? And the other problem that I have is that now the phone won't work. So, even if that interview isn't a scam, they can't call me. <laughs> Rip David, yeah. Like, it's... Yeah, the phone just doesn't work now. But yeah, uh, I'm getting really annoyed that my stuff doesn't work. <laughs> like, I get OBS fixed and then internet's like, <laughs> that's cute. But yeah, sorry about that, guys. Hopefully, they can replace our box. Because I have... Uh, we're getting a nice gaming PC for Christmas that's supposed to be... Oh, Ankles Redeemed Hong Kong, I see. One moment, please. <laughs> Come here. There we go. Let me see. Oh, that's going to be annoying if I don't turn that off. Yay, level 9. Ooh. Do we change Pokemon? I think we probably should. We got Gothitelle.
I'm being asked questions about my supposed job interview. I think it was a scam. Okay, anyway. Let me check my email. I doubt anyone tried to call me, but whatever. Mock punch. Chat, times are hard. I'm gonna lean into um, my my waifu apps uh, development uh, and Patreon and Zazzle merch. Ooh, level 11. Wait, did I level up twice? You all would like this one. It's the garbage Pokemon. <laughs> Actual trash. There we go. All we had to do was level up a little bit. We're fine. You can use the Zazzle I'm making for the cryptid dating sim. Oh my god. Inkles. Yes. If Bobon's fine with that, I'm fine with that. That was one thing that we were talking about that would be really cool, though, is because everybody's art style is so different. And so, like, if we got all the mods together on that and, like, made art for it, it would end up being, like, it would be so cool to see everyone's take. As long as I can use Mirage. Yes. Yes, use Mirage, please. Look at this little beaver! <laughs> Badoof. Badoof. Like, everybody hated this Pokemon from Diamond and Pearl, right? Like, nobody likes Bidoof or Bee Barrel. But, um, the pole dancer. <laughs> um, but then I played Poke Park Wii, and Bee Barrel is in the game. And I walked up to it, and it's like, Bee Barrel! I'm like, oh, I hate you. <laughs> yeah. Zazzle is more of a cryptid, to be honest. Is he? Are you sure about that? Well, I don't know. I'm gonna try not to say too much in that regard. Because, like, there are things that make him a cryptid. But... I can't really specify- Oh, look! He's got that! Look at that! Oh my god! It sets on his head so good! My headcanon is that he is? I mean, yeah. You have to accept it. I mean, you can headcanon whatever you want. What, do you think I'm one of those scrubs who's not gonna let you read the comic because you gay shit people? I love that the Santa hat sits right on his head. That's amazing. Dang, do I have... I can't do that. It is not optional. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. I gotta battle a Pokemon? You're still light years away from facing Brock. Okay. I should have gotten my glasses while the internet was out, but instead I sat here and was like, Greninja! Baban, I think you would like this Pokemon because his tongue is literally a scarf. Yeah, Greninja! Oh, counter. That was bad. Um... Give him the clamp. I like Greninja. Like him just because he's a froggy, to be honest. Yeah. Greninja's great. I wonder if we can find him somewhere. Froakie? No, don't go to sleep. You poop. Froakie is a good thing. Starter.
Dang. Okay, this counter move is not good. Oh wait, I forgot I bought potions. No! Wait, how did it counter me? I didn't even use it. A move that time. Go all out. Use hyper. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh, buckle up. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Hurry. Hurry, Fabio. Don't submit to the poison, Fabio. You can do it. I believe. We did it. Hooray. I leveled up twice. The uh oh. Uh. Hmm. We have a problem. <laughs> Do I have an antidote? Don't use furry attack. I know that says fury. Don't don't yell at me. I know. Ludo, I'm back. My internet died. I also have the the type of ISP where uh my house is in a location that I only get service from the one provider. So, um, when things do go wrong, they're not in a hurry to help us because there's no competition. It's great. I don't have an antidote, I don't think. We're just gonna try to squeeze through this. Gentle squeeze. I just call it Bob on attack. Wait, which one's Bob on attack? The gentle squeeze. Okay, we're just gonna. Okay, we did it. Um. Furry sway. <laughs> wow, rude. I'm a scaly. Yeah. Okay. So here's gonna be something else that's fun. Is I might pass out before I get to the Pokemon Center. Because every four steps I take, I'm losing an HP because of the poison. Wow. We made it. Okay, great. So Fabio is carrying the team. <sighs> I just really I was enjoying streaming I was having so much fun because no one was being gross in chat and my OBS was working and I was having a good time and then my internet went out okay like I just can I please just stream and have fun 
Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Oh, what did you forget to do? You're literally streaming right now. I know, but I'm saying I, I was gonna stop streaming because I was mad, but I was having fun, so I came back. <laughs> I just like streaming. Wait. No, I can't mo- Oh, here. I'll do it. There you go. Can I- Can I click off of your name now, please? Can you- Thank you. Do you have a sword? Enable the clown circle jerk. Yeah, there you go. I didn't ban you. I gave you a sword. Now fight for me. All Pokemon are the rock type. Do you still want to challenge me? Fine then. Show me your best. Oh, wow. This is a better Brock than Brock, to be honest. The cool trick was going to be making you a mod. <laughs> Aw. Can you not mod people, Bobon? Like, as a mod, you can't grant mod to other people? Uh, I need to check something real quick. Yes. Imagine that was probably abused in the past. Oh, yeah. All that comes up in the mod list command, like so. Oh. Wait! Snake versus snake! What crimes will they commit? Uh, oh, wow. Did a lot of damage. I don't see anything. Am I supposed to see something? Um... What was I about to say to you? Oh, yeah, ankles. Just like if people show up and are being weird. I mean, I assume you know what to do. But, you know. Tell them to stop and then time them out. And then if it still continues, then just ban them. I mean, you know. I, I assume you would be able to tell what type of behavior I wouldn't approve of. Cock shotgun. <laughs> oh no! What have I done? Um, Huntail. What level is it? Am I? Oh, he's so ugly. Give him the clamp. Oh no! He has the clamp. Run! Not Nabob. Get Nabob out of there. Get out of there, Nabob. Shotgun. Shotgun's gone. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> I misunderstood the instructions, Cherry. <laughs> Socks, shotgun. Oh no! Oh my god! Oh wait, was he using bide? Uh oh. Hyperfang faster! We did it. Wait a second. Oh. Those aren't Ryu's red panda emotes? I thought they were. Instructions unclear. Pellets mounted on wiener. Oh no. Wow. My mod team is scary. I wouldn't. Chat, I wouldn't. <laughs> Red Panda, yeah. Reminds me of um, Ryusuke's emotes. They're cute. Wait, take this with you. I got TM34. Contain, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, is that actually what you gave me? 
Did you- wait, shh 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 I don't want to talk to you anymore. You lost. You're a loser. I don't talk to losers. Ah. Uh, oh, Vine Whip. Wow, everybody can learn Vine Whip. Okay, who do I teach Vine Whip to? I would either give it to Nabob or Squiddle. Because Nabob needs a little bit of help and Squiddle only knows normal type moves. What do you guys think? Okay, so apparently there's just a phone. As a shrimp, I'd say Nabob. Okay. Nabob knows Vine Whip now. It's gonna be super helpful against the not water Pokemon that Misty's gonna have. I would really like to beat Misty today. That would be fantastic. But I don't know uh, how long it's gonna take me to get through Mount Moon, being that my team and everything else is super unpredictable. <sighs> I also need help wording my chat rules. Um, I mean, I don't want to be, like, super... What's the word I'm looking for? I don't want to be super, like, nitpicky with them, but... Yeah, I think I, I think I need some actual visible rules for chat. Oh, look at that side. <laughs> he just wiggled on over. Oh, it's a plus -ol. Whip it. Wow, that didn't do shit. Give it the clamp! What are those attacks, bro? It's a clamp. I'm giving it the clamp. Oh, what's this now? Um... <sighs> Mammo swine. Oh boy. Yeah, apparently. Oh. Apparently, there is an outage in our area, and that's why my phone is not working now. Uh, but whatever the outage is, it shut everything down, and now it's just messed up the phone. But the website, do you, do you all have the issues with the ISP where it's like, um, they prevent you from telling them that they have a problem unless you jump through extravagant hoops to like deal with it? Come on, you can't say Ekans looks like a bald pink alien. Doesn't? Yeah, it does. It See, that's why these, like, old games are, like, so charming because they're so ugly. Yes, it's a nightmare. Yeah, so, like, they won't let you troubleshoot your service on the website right now. And 
it's so stupid because I know that there's a problem with the box. And what it used to be able to do is it would ping your, your box and it would come back and tell you if it's a problem with the ISP or your box. And it won't let us do that now. We have to jump through so many hoops to even get a phone. Yeah, they d see that's the thing that they have here too is even though that there there's like a physical store where you can walk in and pay your bill and get equipment and all that other crap, it like, you can't call that number directly. You have to call the 800 number and then try to get them to transfer you to a store, but half the time you can't do that. My ISP is fully automated now, even every option of the customer service. Oh my God, that's awful. That's, see, like I, I can see the why they want to do that because it's annoying to have to deal with like a hundred people who are calling you about the same thing and they want it to go through something automated. So it's just kind of like, okay, we have the numbers, we acknowledge there's a problem, but for stuff like this, like the computer is not going to be able to help me with the fact that my router will not hold service. I don't even know. I just waited out. But I do have two internet networks, so one will still work. Maybe that... Well, no, I can't even do that because I only have the one ISP that will service my home. If they don't have a number up, then lots of people Google and find scam sites that claim to have the number, but it's scammers. Wow. See, that's what we try to do. But the only thing that they have is like the, oh, what do you call it? The only thing they have is the 800 number. And it was, I think, last year. Last year at the beginning of the year, um, thunder hit the side, or lightning hit the side of our house. Which, whatever one's the actual bolt, okay? I don't have the brain energy to determine that right now. But it hit the side of the house. And it fried our router and also the Xbox battery pack, the plug into the wall thing. Um, no, I want to learn it. I hit the wrong button. But um, there was a big service outage for a lot of people. And we were trying to get a hold of them to tell them, hey... We realize that you have a service outage, but our box is fried. <laughs> and um, because they knew there was an outage, they just kept playing an, oh, hello, you're beautiful. They kept playing an automated message saying, like, we know our service is down. We'll call you when it's back up, which they never do. They never call you when the service comes back up. But uh, we couldn't get a hold of an actual person to tell them we needed a new box because literally the service thing is set up to be like, okay, we know you're calling to tell us that there's a service outage. We don't want to talk to you. It's so stupid. You could always go to the store, right? I mean, you can, but the chance of them being able to help you is pretty slim. At least I feel like that is. I would be more angry if I drove all the way up there and then they were just like, lol, what do you want me to do about it? The lightning, yeah. Oh, a handsome boy. That hippo looked like a potato. It did look like a potato. Oh, look at you! I love this Pokemon too. I love Apom. Crunch, oh no. Uh-oh. Well, bye, Nabob. Bye. Oh, I'm surprised. I figured that would have been it. Hit potato! Hot potato? Oh, man. If we catch one of those, we're gonna call it hit potato. Hit potato. Yeah. It's true. I do the same. I'll call you later. I promise. I never did. I... Yeah. We're having that problem with a bunch of people right now. Because there's a... Uh, wow. Oh, because it's a psychic type. <sighs> Shit. Should have thought that one through. We're having that problem with a bunch of people because we've had, um, DJ has been waiting on a call back with, um, a 
group of people since June. Um, and we've been in the queue, and once a week we get a call that's like, Hey, we haven't forgotten that you called us. Press this button if you want to stay on the list for us to call you back. And we hit the button every single week, and it's now December, and they still haven't called back. And, yeah. I'm gonna be honest. If I can figure out how to sue the shit out of them, I will. Uh, oh no, it's Utter Monkey. <laughs> That's its hand. It's uh it's like a, a high fiving hand on its tail. I love a palm. That's where my steam name comes from, the A Pomination. Cause of the that Pokemon. Yeah. What? What what? No, it always looks like an udder. What? What do you mean it looks like an udder? Do I need to go get the, um... Do I need to get the Pokédex up? It's Pokédex says it's a hand. That's what I thought. I mean, there... There is an actual cow Pokémon. That has an udder. And in the 3D versions of the game, it, like, stands and it does, like, a bouncing movement while it's, like, idle and the udder, like, jiggles and it's really funny. I legit always thought it was an udder. <laughs> Don't let her snake you, Cherry. Listen. It's fine. Nabob is now... Cresselia! Ooh. That one's supposed to be, like, a pseudo-legendary or something. That sprite looks nice, though. Wait, why is that not super effective? Uh-oh, it's about to skull bash me. Give it the clamp! <laughs> I mean, most people working at the call center are most likely noobs who don't know what the fuck they're doing, and I can speak of experience. I can, too. I agree. Isn't that just a hand? It was a hand in the anime. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it's just a hand. Is phone still out? Yes. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Like, I really do not like our internet service provider at all, period. Because they, they do the thing, um, what's the thing that they do that I really like? They will tell you that they're going to come fix something, and if they feel like you're wasting their time, they'll tell you that they showed up to your house and no one answered the door. Um, they've done that to us before, and everybody was sitting in the living room with the, uh, the curtains open, waiting for the dude to show up to the house, and he just like blatantly lied and didn't show up. Double edge. Stop it. Yeah. Get hit with recoil. Get hecked. Um, what else have they done that's really fun? Oh, anytime they need to fix something, like if it's an equipment issue, they will tell you that it'll take a week. Uh... Even if it only takes a little bit to fix because they don't want to get in a hurry to fix it because it's, like, annoying to them. Like, how, do, how dare they have to do their job? Um. They've done us like that before. The last time I had a really big issue with them back in, like, uh, March or April, I think. The, the internet went out, and the guy comes, like, first of all, we try to get the guy to fix it, and they're like, okay, um, we don't have an appointment available for another week, and, um, we're like, well, yeah, we have to take any appointment that you have, and they're like, okay, don't worry, if we have any earlier times, we'll, um, you know, we'll head up there. We're like, okay, cool. So, the appointment time in the matter of 30 minutes went from a week out to in an hour. Which was really annoying because I don't like people just showing up at my house. 
And the guy shows up to fix it. And then he's like, oh, it's going to take us a week to fix this. There's nothing we can do about it. The problems with the pole in front of your house. So we have to get a tech out here. And that could take a week. And we're like, wow, that's shitty of you, but okay. So the tech comes out and fixes it by the next day, which is fantastic. Except my phone never stopped work or my phone never started working again. And then we had to call them back to have them come get the phone and fix it. And that tech showed up to my house and stared at my phone box for about five minutes. Went outside and chewed a bunch of tobacco for 30 minutes and came back in and was like, I can't fix it. <laughs> I can't stand it. What do you mean with your phone? Yeah, it's a house phone. It's one of those... We have one of those services where everything is connected through the same provider. So it would be like phone, internet, and cable. Uh, except we just don't have cable. Just because, you know... We have like Hulu and YouTube and everything else and nobody was really watching the cable so we just don't have it. But yeah, um... Before, like, the issue usually with my stuff is that the internet will go out, but the phone will still work, and I just have to reset the internet box. Uh, but now there's, like, an actual outage. So my phone and my internet went out, and I reset the router, and the internet came back on, but the phone didn't. Which, normally, I don't really care. I... <laughs> I'm kind of just annoyed with the house phone because it went out 30 minutes or like 10 minutes or something within the time I was supposed to have that interview. And I'm still not really sure if it was a scam or not, <laughs> the interview. But, you know, them calling me would have confirmed or denied that. <laughs> so I kind of would have liked to have that um, known and dealt with. But whatever. I'm gonna get rid of the cable as well, but I don't think they give us that option. Really? They don't give you, like, um, packages? Do you not want to give them your mobile number? Uh, I mean, it's not a matter of I don't want to give it to them. It's like... Uh, here's the other fun thing about my phone number, or my, my house phone. My internet is the only reason I get phone service. So, if the internet is out, nobody can contact me on my cell phone because the actual phone service doesn't work here. <laughs> like, the cell phone service doesn't work here. So, if you actually wanted to contact me at my house, unless you have FaceTime, you have to call the house phone or you won't reach me. <laughs> Sinister, welcome to the stream. Yeah. So, I mean, they could call me on my cell phone. It's just that, you know, the, the chances of the connection staying while they were on the phone with me, it would be slim and none. Yeah. <laughs> Yay, look at your emote. It's so cool. Looked at such a good job. I love the colors on it. They're so good. Fabio is carrying this whole team. Although, Nabob is doing good too. I think when Nabob evolves, we're going to be in good shape. But, uh, Squiddle's probably going to have to take a hike. <laughs> He's not doing us any favors. 
He did do great. I like the ones that he did for um, ads and bubbles as well. Those turned out really, really cute. Sinister, yes. When I get my new tablet, I'm gonna make some more emotes. I'll probably expand on the ones I have, but yeah, I need to. <laughs> I need my sheet back. I'm gonna grab some grubs, so we'll be back in a second. And yeah, I really like theirs as well. Okay. Oh, what is this? Oh, interesting. I have family who's like, what's going on with the internet? <laughs> It sucks, that's what's going on. Uh, you got a Red Bull in the fridge? <laughs> Red Bull gives you wings. What is this one? Beat it up. No, don't use minimize. That move is cheating. Give him the, no, not teleport. Oh well, we're leaving, I guess. Oh, oh no, that's bad, don't do that. Uh, I also have Red Bull, but it's supposed to go with my Jaeger. No, please, I don't want to play this game. I hate it when they do the shrinky thing and then you can't do the punch. Ugh. I keep walking back to the Pokemon Center and I forget that I can... Warp back. Uh, hello, more like yellow. Kakashi. Long time no see. How you doing? Really does give you wings. I flew back in here. <laughs> nice. How are you? Better now that my internet's behaving. And OBS is behaving. This is going to be my Christmas week game. I am going to go back to playing Kingdom Hearts, but like, I have to rearrange the living room for the PC for Christmas. Um, so then I, I, I move my PlayStation in here with my stream set up. Or I need to figure out how I want to do that, actually. It just depends. It just depends, because I do, I'm going to get my stream set up on the PC also. Ooh. Look at this Pangoro sprite that they made. This is amazing. This pose reminds me of something Inkles would draw. And better too, because I'm getting my PC in a week. Ah, same! Are you getting a PC for Christmas? <laughs> Alright, we got a PC as like a family gift for Christmas. It's like everybody gets to use it, but that's awesome. Yeah, it's a great pose. It is. It's a power pose. Pangoro is not taking any shits. Oh, chat refreshed. Can I get one too? Yeah! 
More like a personal gift for me. Yeah, that's that works too. I mean, it, if I'm being completely honest, I think that the PC is more for my husband than anything. Because he kind of didn't get anything else for Christmas. But he made sure that everyone gets something out of it. So that's kind of cool. Oh, Zangoose. Uh, switch. Yeah. Well, let's Squiddle try. <gasps> Where's Neb? It's Giro! I need to read Neb's other fic that he sent me forever ago. I have it bookmarked and I forgot. Neb is a good writer, though. I get like the best of the best PC in the store where I bought it and I let the store make it for me. Oh, so like, is it like you put it together, like you pick what parts you want and they assemble it for you? Because that's awesome. No, that's not what I wanted. <sighs> Gotta keep healing. Blech. That's awesome. I know DJ's laptop is like that. Where he picked out all the parts and then they assembled it and they mailed it. I guess this computer is kind of like that too. Because he found one pre-built with all the parts he wanted in it. Except for I think he said the motherboard. But he said he can replace that later. That's rad. A laptop's no good for gaming. No, he just used his for like his content stuff. That laptop's also like, oh my god. I think that laptop must be like six years old now. Wait, are you- did I- Did I fight you already? Oh, I guess so. <laughs> Does anybody have any fun Christmas plans? I'm gonna make food and eat food. Oh, man. I'm gonna tell everybody not to let me, um, actually open my stuff until I cook Christmas dinner. Because if I get into that new tablet, I won't cook anything and the house is gonna starve. Seven years old and it's poop, yeah. No, not really, just unpacking my PC. That's, that's Christmas plans right there. I am excited to make a cheesecake, though. Wait. I wonder if this is a version of the game where you gotta go- no, wait. Which game is it where you have to go get Misty and make her come back to the gym? Because if I have to do that today, we're not going to get to her. Christmas plans. Yes. I'm going to make... Eek! Did you touch me? No. Six feet, buddy. I'm really excited, though. Because when I get the new uh, tablet, I'm going to work on my stream. I'm going to make overlays. And alerts. And I'm going to be able to go back to doing YouTube stuff because I'll actually be able to export time lapse videos. It's going to be great. Life is going to be good. Stands for big brain. <laughs> Still waiting to hear about the phone. Fire spin. Spin.
glass. <laughs> I don't know anything about Pokemon, so don't ask me if something's good or not. <laughs> That's okay. This one is, um... What is it called? I think it's like Red 721. But they take Pokemon from up through Gen 6. So there's like 700 or something of them. But... You can only have 150 in this game. So it randomizes them. Uh, and you get 150. And all the moves are randomized. And the items are randomized. So it's not even like original red version. Everything has been swoopity swooped. I thought there used to be a Pokeball over here. But I could be wrong. Oh, it's a burb. <laughs> it's ruffle it. Yeah, we'll just... I would like to try to get to Misty. I just want to finish. I, I just want to play. Let's, let's get badges. No grinding, just badges. Oh, I forgot. I hate Mountain Moon. Okay. What's up, Victory Bell? I literally only need to finish one hand and I can start coloring. I hate hands. Yeah, hands... I don't know. Sometimes I don't mind hands very much. And sometimes I do. But I can tell you that when I draw hands, it's either... Sausage finger or immaculate hand. This is just a joke? What's the joke? Do you want to be the sun in my life? Oh. Uh. <laughs> Wait. Why? Why? Why are we making the joke? Did I miss context here? Ha! <laughs> okay. All right. You saved it. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> Sandra, fifty. All right. <laughs> I was scared for a second. I'm not going to lie. I've had some weird people in my chat, but you you you, you back that one up. Yeah, that one was good. That was a really really good joke. I was scared for a second there. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> Okay. This thing is steel. <laughs> what was the punchline of that? That was really good. So stay 150 million kilometers away from me. We need a... A badumps. Why can't I make jokes like that in ads as chat? <laughs> I try. I try to make good joke and jokes in ads as chat and I never do. The most successful I've been was tanks for the stream. And I think we even agreed that's not even really success. It was just cheesy. <laughs> How to avoid people, just question people this. Oh, yeah. That was good. Is that why you're banned from their chat? Wait, what? Ads? Ads, you didn't ban me since this morning, did you? <laughs> I don't think I'm banned in anyone's chat that I know of. 
Maybe cools. I don't know. I haven't I haven't tried. Oh. I forgot it was Monday. I was going to change my stream title to Motivational Monday. Why? I have holiday. Oh, are you, is this like a Christmas break for school or work? Three weeks? Ooh, that's exciting. I technically, I guess I'm technically having a holiday break just because um, my iPad died and now I can't work on my comic. Or I can work on my comic, I just think it's pointless if it's just going to get deleted again. <sighs> Still waiting to see if this is fixed. Oh. Oh wow, they made this thing look, um, I can't tell if it's looking forward or backwards, to be honest. So I don't have to see the annoying people from my school. <laughs> That's a mood. Uh, we're gonna switch for Fabio. Oh, I don't like that sound. Does anyone remember what level Ekans evolves? I can look it up, but wondering, uh, when I can, oh my god, um, hmm, I want that, do you see the emotes are just, no, I see the emotes, the, the four. 22? Okay, that's not bad. Uh, is it shiny? No, I don't think this, uh, this does shinies, but I like the Pokemon. Um, Moonblast? Wow. Oh. Catch it. Yeah. Okay. 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 Hey. Insect. <laughs> Lives in the shadows of tall trees where it eats insects. It is attracted by light at night. Uh. Dang, what do we call him? What do we call the Aerodactyl? Hmm. 
I don't know. I want to name it something. It's insect. I don't know. I'll probably just leave it. I don't even know if I want to use it, but I caught it because it's cool. I don't think I've ever... Uh, I can't remember if I've ever caught an Aerodactyl before. Or like, used one. Fuck Fortnite. <laughs> I have never played Fortnite. Another victory bell. You shouldn't because it's poop? Okay. I'll take your word for it. I'm usually like too afraid to play online games anyway because I'm bad at them and people yell at me. Um, I played a little bit of Apex and that's about it. And mostly I played Apex because people like look in the chat just baby me through it. <laughs> Or Joxon if he's lurking, yeeting me into the lava pit. Apex! Yeah. Every time I mention play video games, kids at school are like, do you play Fortnite? Yeah. It's one of those that are like free to play, isn't it? I've just never actually played it. It's... Downloaded for some reason on my PlayStation and I can't figure out who downloaded it. Or if my PlayStation just decided that I needed it. What? Oh. Oh. Oh, this is a legendary. <laughs> Uh, DJ secretly plays it. Uh, I th think that DJ actually was the one that downloaded it because one of his friends plays it. And I think he got it just so he can play with his friend, but then never played it. Like, I, I do think that's actually what happened, which I don't care because, you know, it's not hurting anything by being on the PlayStation. But, um... It updated, so it was like, oh no! Oh, it's gonna be that way. It's not gonna let me catch it. Okay. I don't, I'm out of Pokeballs now. What is that sound? But no, uh, I, I think that he actually did download it and forgot about it. <laughs> Oh. It's Team Rocket. They're Pokemon gangsters. Chief! Chief, what are you doing? Chief wants to fight! My dog wants to fight. I need my dog to come in so I can give him a bath. Is Stinky Boy. You send the message. Okay. Rapid Ash with Bubble Beam. I see you. One thing Gen 1 Pokemon really needs is a... Uh... Oh. What was the... The experience share. That's the thing I want. Oh. Nabab fainted, I see. Interior crocodile alligator. Take that, chief. You bad dog. <laughs> oh, yes, those cave fish. They get you every time. I 
I'm wondering if tomorrow when I stream, if I should preemptively reset my router to see if I can prevent this from happening. I'm so sad I can't catch this. I'm gonna have to try to remember uh, Mount Moon has this. So when I get better Pokeballs, I can come back. That's always the sad thing with randomizers is like you always find Mewtwo in the in the noob area and you can't catch him because he's a legendary so like all the pokeballs don't even hit it okay I would like for Nabab to evolve while we're streaming today, but we'll see. What is this? Oh, bron Bronzong? Yeah. This guy. This guy. Oh, I need a repel. Oh. Oh, what is this? Swana? Why is it so angry? This is such an angry br oh. Uh. Oh man. Oh, I'm so mad right now for a reason I can't tell you. Uh, suffice it to say it's a Zazzle spoiler. But I would have had a really good nickname for this Pokemon. If chapter 5 was gonna come out like it was supposed to. Oh well. Uh, what? Don't sneak up on me. I mean, I walked right in front of you, so. It's Gary O. Rival 1. <laughs> Vulpix. And Gligar. I don't remember what type Gligar is. It looks like they integrated that sprite from like gold and silver, but it came across really well. Gligar is like bug flying or something. It's never what I expect it to be. I know that. I like. For some reason I expect it to be like rock or ground type. But I'm I think you're right. I don't I don't It's definitely a flying type, I think. Sangoose. Every time I see Zangoose, I think of the the Gur line from Invader Zoom. Can I be a mongoose dog? You have to go through this cave to get to Cerulean City. I'm on the road to Cerulean City. Whirlipede. That actually, uh, not Whirlipede specifically, but the Scolipede that it evolves into is actually one of my favorite um, bug type Pokemon. It's pretty good. If I can get, um, if I cannot get Chief to come in to take a bath, can we watch a Christmas movie in the Discord? And what Christmas movie do you all want to watch? When you inevitably say yes to me. Wait, what did I hit? Did I hit Skull Bash? That's not what I wanted to use, but that's fine. Hey. 
I only watch shitty Christmas movies. So can we watch Grandma Got Run Over by a Reindeer? Because me and my family make fun of them. That's fine. Can we watch Grandma Got Run Over by a Reindeer? It's a bad Christmas movie, but I love it. <laughs> Yes. I want that one. That one! <laughs> I want that one! <laughs> yes, let me look and see if I can find it easily while I'm spamming the button. That movie is so funny. Will I change Pokemon? Nah. It's fine for right now. Oh, what is... Okay. Furry attack. Okay. Yeah, the movie, not the song. <laughs> oh, the nostalgia critic has Grandma Got Run Over by a Reindeer. I don't think so. Not today, nostalgia critic. Where am I... Is this still not done yet? Can you stop with the furry attack, please? I'm looking to see if it's in the the one website, the the one that has everything. No, is it not? Oh no. Now how am I going to watch it? This movie exists somewhere. I can't believe that this movie is so bad no one wants to yo-ho it. Correction, I can't uh I can't believe this movie is so bad I'm the only one who wants to yo-ho it. Oh, I found it. Okay. Never mind. It's here. Okay. We're good. We can watch it. I'm supposed to be able to do screen sharing from my phone, which would be really cool uh, and convenient. If that is a thing I can do. I just don't know how it works in Discord. Has anybody done screen sharing from their phone in Discord? I'll forget about it and like check my messages and everyone's gonna see in my DMs. And know who I've been snaking. Wait, don't I already have one of those? Is it another vine whip? Oh, it's water pulse. Ooh, yeah. Give me a water move. Ah. <sighs> Who learns the water move? Fabio or Nabob? What does Nabob have? Oh, yeah. Let's get rid of Clamp and give him water pulse. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yep, water pulse you. Um, running out of time. I just, um... I will consider getting through Mount Moon of Victory for this stream. And then we can do a bunch more gym badges tomorrow. I might be able to get through the grass one? No, wait. That depends. There's a bunch of, like, side game stuff to go through for that. Definitely Misty and Surge, though. It's bigger in here than I thought. Line art done. Did you post it? Pumpkaboo! Oh, it's cute! 
Baban, that's the one that I drew for WV. I love that you guys draw Zazzle in fun ways. I like seeing the interpretations. The pumpkin one is adorbs. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, it's got its head cocked to the side. I could not tell where its face was. I can't stand this Pokemon. It gets on my nerves really bad. Like, probably this one in particular won't, but uh, when I was playing X and Y, there was a place that I was trying to level up that had a bunch of those, and the moveset is really infuriating, and it made it very hard for me to level up, but you get good experience off of them. The Zazzle lines? Did, where is it? Oh, I see. I've been tagged and whipped now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. That is awesome. I love it. Oh, Latios. Oh, I don't have any Pokeballs. This is a legendary. Oh well. All of the legendaries are apparently in the cave. But, um, yeah, I like him. He reminds me of, like, a Wendigo, but then also, like, the way the lines are on the body makes me think he's, like, um, like a treant or something like that. I don't know if that makes sense, but it's, it's so cool. I can't wait to see the colors. Oh, wow. Chief's back. Gligar. I really want to level up my other Pokemon, but I also really want to get out of the cave, so I think I'm just going to let Fabio tank his way through it. Numel. Numel, Numai. <laughs> Numel, Numel, Numai. <laughs> Cherry defeated Chief as usual. Actually, do you know what? If I can screen share from my phone, I can watch Grandma got run over by a reindeer while I give Chief a bath. I can do both. And I can leave my mic muted because I have to sing to Chief while he's in the bathtub or he gets upset. And I know, like, that sounds ridiculous, but, like, I have not, like, um, actual lullaby singing, but you just kind of have to, like, sing song talk to him or he gets upset and antsy. I didn't see what Pokemon- oh, Carvana. Wait, isn't Carvana one of those websites where you get, like, reports about your car or something. I don't even remember. See, look, you could totally do something like this. 
Look could hack a Pokemon ROM and then put the Babunch in it. Oh wait, I wanted to talk to you. Whoa, you shocked me. Oh, you're just a kid. Wow. Oh. He's buff. More elite four people. Totodile! Oh, oh. <laughs> I gotta send this to DJ. That's DJ's favorite Pokemon. I guess technically for alligator is, but that's funny. Okay, yeah, I think we're gonna get through uh, Mount Moon and save and call it a stream. And then we'll pick up from here tomorrow. It would be cool if we could get all the way through this uh, by Thursday, but we'll see. Cause, yeah, I'm not streaming on Christmas as I'm sure you all can imagine. Meditate. Oh, Mary. That's the first form of Fabio, Mary. I remember playing Pokemon as a kid, and I caught the Mareep, and I just was kind of leveling up everything because I didn't understand, like, what these new Pokemon were. And then I evolved- no. I watched the Entei movie that had Flaffy in it. And when I was playing Gold version, I found Mareep, and I was like, okay, there's no way this thing does not evolve into Ma uh, that Flaffy Pokemon. I want the pink sheep. So I caught it and leveled it up, and I had the cute little pink sheep Flaffy forever. And I was just really happy kid with a pink sheep living my best life. And then Flaffy evolved into Ampharos, and I fell in love. And it's been my favorite Pokemon ever since. I love Ampharos. I was really mad at first when they Mega evolved him, but I've, I've learned to love it, so it's fine. He gets great hair and becomes a dragon, so... That's why, that's why he's called Fabio. Let's see. Um, where is the... <laughs> so, oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. No big deal. It's just Arceus. No. So, um, my mother-in-law called, um, our ISP since the, um, the bill is in her name. And, uh, asked him about the phone and was on hold forever just so they can say, oh, there's an outage and our techs are working on it. And she messaged me and she's like, there's no emoji for the face I'm making right now. And I said, I have one. And I sent the, the middle finger emoji. <laughs> The flats barely took any time. Yeah, see, that's the great thing about Zazzle. He has three colors as a base color palette. <laughs> and you're done. Oh, there's Gotharita. I like that one. Unova has good psychic type Pokemon. Posted it in Whip. Oh, wow, really? That's not you. Oh! Ooh, I like how you did the the hair lavendery too. Oh, he's gonna look so cool, Ankles. 
It looks amazing. I can't wait to see how you finish it. I need... I would really like a... DJ wanted me to do a campaign thing where I had a bunch of people do fan art and feature it in a video that he plays like the Glitter Biscuits audio in. And I might have to get up with a bunch of you guys and see if I can use it because a lot like all the Zazzle fan art is just too good. I love it so much. It feels so comfy now when you do line art. I love your line art. It's very good. Is it like, have you adjusted your drawing tablet to make it easier on yourself? Team Rocket will find the fossils and revive and sell them for cash. Oh, it's three o'clock. We gotta get through this cave. I'm gonna take solace in knowing if my internet didn't go out, we'd already be through the cave. Wait, it doesn't affect shield on? Kind of, but also just learning to use it more. That's fair. Uh, potion. Oh, I have a max potion? Well, I should have been using that. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I have looked some stuff up and I, no, 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 not, not that, not that. I've looked some stuff up about my new tablet and it comes with a stylus and I am supposed to have pin pressure with it. So I really hope that's a thing. Oh, I only have one more fire punch. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I know what I should do. I know what I should do. Hang on. We're gonna use Max Potion on Nabab. And we're gonna switch. Hang in there, Fabio. You have to... Oh, God. I'll be so mad if I have to go all the way back through this cave. But I'm really looking forward to having pin pressure again. Not that I'm gonna know what to do with it, but we'll see. Uh, it'll give me something fun to learn. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. You did it, Nabob. I'm proud of you. Uh, yeah. We need to switch and use our last, uh, fire punch on Ice Lady. I know his dialogue for the dating sim. Please tell me. You gonna eat those peaches? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> he got a peach for you, all right. Cool. Another firestone. Okay, I don't think there's anything else over there. This dude is gonna be like, Hey, stop. I found these fossils. They're both mine. Okay. Left or right, chat. I can pick one. They're not going to end up being the fossil that we think they are. So which one should I pick? Left or right? Me and Fu? Oh, he's T-posing. I don't like that. Don't T-pose. Parasect. I can't ever see that Pokemon's name without thinking of the the thing um no we'll just leave it how it is oh wait what oh cool so i sent that when my internet went out and because i just opened twitch on my phone uh it just sent so ignore that my internet did not shit itself we're good the internet's fine please disregard that's past Cherry coming to haunt me. Time magic. It be what it is what it do.
Hey, I got four twenty dollars. Sweet. Uh, nice tar <laughs> nice try, time traveler. Cherry arguing with past Cherry in the chat. Yeah, <laughs> get out of here, past Cherry. We already dealt with your problems. The future's fine. We did it. We made it out of the cave. Coming out of the cave and I've been doing just fine. Yeah. Did you see the flats? Oh, yeah. Yeah, go look at them, Bob. on They're great. They're very good color choices. I'm so looking forward to seeing how spooky this is going to be. What? what? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <gasps> Wait! <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, Juicy. Just gonna give him some reflection on the butt. Good. Polish that damn thing. No big deal, you guys. I just got a master ball. It's fine. No big deal, just a master ball. Uh, see, but now I'm tempted to peek in there and see if Misty's there. Um, hold on. Yeah, okay. What if... What if we just... What if we just go... Hello? That guy stayed in on the water, that's fine. Oh, she's here, okay. Well, I'm gonna... YOLO. We're just gonna fight Misty. I think we can do it. Uh... I should see if I should get- I'm gonna get potions, though, first. We'll get potions first, and then we'll fight Misty. I'm curious... ...as well. Um, maybe after we finish this, we can, like, fill out the Pokédex, too. I don't know. We'll see. Take my money. My money. Okay. And then we'll go, uh, Amber just went live. We'll go raid Amber to the core. Oh, right. <laughs> Walking on the water. <laughs> Splash. I'm first up. Let's do it. Okay. Cool trainer wants to fight. More whips. Tyranitar. Oh, it's my favorite dragon. It's a baby dragon. You, it's a baby dragon. My terrible Joey Wheeler impression. Okay, but can I, can I hack Pokemon and make it Yu-Gi-Oh instead of Pokemon? So like, I can have Dark Magician, can I do that? Or I could just play Yu-Gi-Oh games, that would probably work too. Uh, I'm gonna say no, but I'm gonna swap swap out to Fabio. I really should give Aerodactyl a chance. But I don't really like the moveset. I just like Aerodactyl. Uh-oh, it learned Gunk Shot! Quick, get it before it gunks! Okay.
Shadow Claw. Oh. Um. Yeah, I think I'll replace Slam. Because I don't really like Slam. Okay. I must be thinking of gold and silver where you have to go find Misty and you have to go across the Nugget Bridge to get to her because she's like simping a boy or something. I mean, sorry, shrimping. She's shrimping because she's a water trainer. She's shrimping the boys uh, and you got to tell her to stop shrimping and get back to the gym. Look at this waddle. There he goes. I'm more than good enough for you. Misty can wait. Okay. I mean, she's right there, bro. She can hear you. Juggler wants to fight. He only has one ball. That it's Baby Gamzee. Aw, Baby. Oh, no. It's Nabab versus Gamzee. Oh, he high jump kicked. That's exciting. My shrimps bring on... <laughs> My shrimps bring all the boys to the yard. My shrimp cocktails bring all the... Wait, no. That's not working the way I want it to. I'm gonna just stop there before I say something I regret. Hands no bab gun. <laughs> you know what to do. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I want this Mime Jr. It knows a lot of kicks. Okay. Hands Nabab gun. Okay, I'm curious though. Uh. Oh. Flame. <laughs> Area. Oh! Oh, it actually has a place where we can find it? Okay, hang on a second. This is inter- well. See, I don't know. Actually, I don't know if this is going to work the right way. What is Mount Moon, it says, is there. What's this down here, it says. Route 15. Well, look, I would like to have a Mime Junior. I don't know how you get it to evolve into Mr. Mime, though. Have you guys seen the the new version of Mr. Mime that's in Sword and Shield? It has like a weird mustache. <laughs> I think I have both Mr. Mimes. I have to check on my game. I know that I had a Nintendo Switch Online for a month and I played Sword constantly and Mystery Traded and like a, did the Wonder Trade nonstop. Because I wanted the Galarian Ponyta and I got it like two days before my Nintendo Switch Online ran out finally. And I just peaced out after that. <laughs> okay. Oh, cool trainer. Cool trainer Misty. Go, go! It's Goat Dad! We have Gamzee and Goat Dad! Uh... <coughs> Oh, that's not good. Oh, wait, we have a fire move. <laughs> go, go, gadget helicopter. <laughs> yes, exactly. Okay. Clang! Um... I have an X attack. Should I be using it? Bone club. You don't have any bones. You are metal. Oh, that hurts!
hurts really bad. Oh, wow. That is some dog duty right there. I should have just switched to Fabio the whole time because I forget fire is super effective against steel. Like a big dummy. But whatever. It's fine. <laughs> Cascade badge. Hooray. Uh, all Pokemon. Blah, blah, blah. I can use cut. Oh, yeah. HMs. I forgot about those. <sighs> okay. So... Um, oh, I have a lot of stuff. Absorb. Nah, whoa, I'll go through some of this stuff next time. But yeah, next time we will go... Oh, man. I have to go do the whole boat and stuff to get to... The... Yeah. Okay. It'll be fine. You know what? It's fine. We don't have to finish this whole game this week. It just would be nice to. Okay. Alright. That was fun. Except for when Bee Barrel killed my internet. But aside from that, it was really fun. Um, but I'm gonna end the stream. And we're gonna raid Amber to the core. Uh, I want to say thank you to everyone for coming. Thank you, ads, for the 69 biddies and... Oh, where did your name go? Hang on. I high risk for the follow. Thank you everyone for stopping by today and coming back <laughs> after the internet died. Uh, and I'll see you all tomorrow. I banned anyone who talked in chat like you wanted. Thanks, Inkles. Good job. Good job being a mod. Thank you also to my mods who are always just really cool. So, yeah. We're gonna go raid Amber to the core. She's playing Fall Guys, so... Go be nice and say hi to Amber. Please start the raid. Oh no, Twitch, please. Don't be. Don't do this. Okay. Alright, well, tw uh, something went wrong? No, don't do that. Oh, okay. It's, it's working. It's working. You can go do the raid now. Okay. Alright, we're good. Bye, everyone. <laughs>